Hello everyone, this is Dream Big Budgets. My name is Natalie and today we will be doing our calf stuffing. Oh my god, it's been a minute, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm super happy to start this back up and uh, see how much more money we can save, even though the month is very short at this point, but we're sticking in there. And um, I hope you enjoy. Let's just jump right in. Okay, so as always, now um, I do have my uh, budget set up here so you can follow along with me as I cast stuff, but I will put it off to the side a little bit so I can maneuver around um, my binders. But before we get into that, I wanted to update this uh, bill tracker just to kind of reflect where we're at right now. So we're on June. Um, State Farm, I paid for technically the rest of the year. So I'm just going to put it for November because I'm not sure where their six months restarts. So I'm just going to do that. And then uh, Sunlink, I'm not sure. Well, it should have gotten paid. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I paid Sunlink. Um see my days are all mixed up I don't know what's happening anymore and then bark box for June was free so paid and then rumkey got paid and technically it should cover the next payment as well uh, because I put extra in there and water I think I did the same thing but we'll wait for next month and see and then Hulu got paid as well. Okay, now we go. And now to go into our debt a little bit before um, I get into the cash stuffing because this is going to be really quick. Last time we did this updated credit card debt and mortgage, um, this is where we were at. And now Chase is paid off, Lowe's is paid off. And our mortgage, we made a $10,000 payment. So our debt now, so update, no more credit card debt. And our mortgage is at 109 right now. So... This is all that we have left. And we do plan on putting a little, like another bigger chunk um, into the mortgage after we finalize everything with the fence and we're sure we have everything that we need to buy. After that, we can draw the line and see how much money we have left and whatever uh, we can throw at it, we're gonna throw at it. I'm hoping to get close to the 10K, if not lower. That's not gonna be possible with what we have right now. But I'm hoping I can save enough to where we can get it down in maybe a month or two. So that's where we're at with our debt, which honestly, not too bad, um, considering we don't have to worry about credit cards um, anymore. And if something, God forbid, happens, we at least have that uh, to cover things if we don't have the cash. So this is where we're at with our debt right now. Okay, now that that is sorted, I don't know why I was putting it away. <laughs> now that that is sorted, we can go into the cash stuffing. So as always, we um, start with my wallet, but uh, there's been some, some changes around for um, our situation right now because we have to take a trip um to visit some family members today so um there's gonna be some expenses there i'm not sure how that's gonna affect what we have in here um but we'll we'll figure it out um we're definitely gonna need more than that for gas because i didn't account for that but um yeah and we're doing 
change, which I used up most of it because we needed to fill up on water. So this is the, yeah, and we filled up three bottles. So I had a bunch of quarters, which thankfully I didn't have to go take more money out on anything. I had enough, so um, I'm happy about that. Okay. So that's the only quarter. So this one is going to go in there. And I still haven't emptied these out. I probably should soon. And then as always, everything else goes in our coffee cache here. When do you guys uh, take your change out? Uh, and what do you do with it once you actually have the cash for it, like actual bills? What do you do with this cash? I'm, I keep wondering if I should just put it in my sinking funds or savings challenge. I'm not sure what to do with it yet, so I would love some suggestions. Okay, now we go to groceries, which is gonna get a 50, but we never counted the cash. What am I doing? You can tell I haven't been doing this for a minute. <laughs> okay. So we have 150, 250, 70, 90, 310, 30, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 4, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. So 435. Okay. That wasn't completely horrible could have done better but that's fine <laughs> there we go and now we can actually start so we have a 50 in groceries which is probably going to buy us some food on the road and things like that then dollar store isn't going to get anything and then gas is going to get 70 there we go and that was my wallet now we can move over to our sinking funds so i still kept it at 50 so this has 70 and our total is 50. okay now short term starts off with child care which child care is going to get 20. So now child care has 120, 40, 140. There we go. So that's a 20 and we have a total of 140. What am I doing? Okay, Maze is going to get a 20. So now she has 50, 70, 90. Let me know if you prefer me filling it out like this, where I have an actual or just a total or just keep it to where I can, I, I only track it and not write it down whatsoever. Cause I know it adds some time. So I wanna make sure that you're not here for a very long time. So if this, um, if you can do without the adding on the totals and stuff, let me know down in the comments and I will take it into account credit card isn't going to get anything and then giveaway is going to get a 15 so that's a 5 and a 10 so now giveaway has 20 30 35 this one is always kind of <laughs> hard to open okay I'm going to do it for this video and then depending on the answers, I will switch it up if necessary in my next one. So that was short term and then long term starts off with games. Oh, see, this is where I messed up. 
Oh my gosh. Okay. Because for some reason I didn't put those two in order. Okay, so giveaway got 10. That's what happened there. And then games is getting 15. Okay. So now games has 50, 60, 65, 70. This is now 70 and giveaway um, I think has 30 yeah okay and we're back on track health is going to get a 20 apparently I wanted more <laughs> and now health has a hundred fifty seventy ninety ninety five 195 so it got 20 and now it's at 195 I wish I put an extra 5 in there so it can be at 200 but oh well our Opoop fund is at what am I doing is going to get 15 so now it has 120, 30, 5, 135. There we go. Okay, and then Black Friday is going to get 15 as well. So now it has 110, 20, 530 135 wait what 110 20 yeah 130 I don't know why I said 135 <laughs> so now we have 130 there we go that was it for our sinking funds and now we move over to our Christmas challenge which is gonna get finished today okay so we have let's see I'm gonna go to the big one The big one is going to let me know. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do some purple. Or a 20. So 20. Yeah, I was very excited to to get our Christmas situated considering it's half a year so yeah I I could not be happier to just get this done and then I pretty much only want to add maybe the 80 to get it to an actual 1k um, in a either in a separate challenge or just add it as I go that way um, we can just have clear um, 1K for Christmas, Black Friday, because we sometimes um, shop for Christmas on Black Friday. So if there's anything that we see that would be great for uh, Christmas for somebody or for ourselves, we're just gonna use those funds for it. Yeah, I'm using all of the colors. There we go. Okay. 
because I wanted to really push for Christmas to be out of the way and taken care of before we got into anything anything else because I I know how it was last year last year we did not have a good time it was not planned at all we had to scramble around for cash to figure it out just to cover everybody and it was just it was a mess so I want to make sure this year we're good I'm just gonna do yellow on the bottom too and here we are so now um, from what I calculated before this it should be 200 <clears throat> So 100 and 50, 70, 80, 90, 200. I should have um, a 920 in here. So 500, 6, 7, 8, 5, 7, 9, 9. 10, 5, 20. So 9, 20. Yep. And we're all done with our Christmas challenge here as well. I'm just gonna fill this. I like having both trackers. Um, because one I can always keep in the binder and the other one you can see so much better on camera but I don't know how everybody else feels about me coloring in too but this one is a lot faster so now we have both of them sorted so these were the two challenges I used um, for my Christmas so one was 400, one was 520. That's why I have the 920. Um, and that's why I want to add an extra 80 at one point or another to just make it an even thousand. And there we go. And that will be able to go in the bank once it hits that 1K. And just sit there until it's time for it to get used up. So let's see. This got finished on June 19th. There we go. And like with all of my other challenges, this one goes in the back with the finished ones. Okay, so now that that's done, I still have a little extra cash um from some of our um we sold a couple things on facebook marketplace so I have a little bit left over so i got two 20s and four fives so that's 60 in total let's see what we can do what do we want to do do we just want to get closer to our watch time? Because I got to get 80 in there. Or should I just put it in here? Okay. I'm going to start on this one. Like heavily do this one. That way Black Friday can be somewhat sorted too. Um, or from... Christina at The Supernatural Life, if you um, haven't checked her out yet, go do so. I will leave her link down in the description. I will have her tagged, actually, and go check her out. I bought this off of her, um, her Etsy shop. I love Supernatural, but she's got everything Supernatural. I don't. 
Um, but this is basically the supernatural version of the Savopoly. I'm actually going to roll a dice for this and start it because I've been meaning to start it for a while. But I've just been putting it off because the amounts are a little bit bigger. Um, but I'm hoping with the 60 we can do a little bit of damage on it. And um, maybe with this, once I get to 80, I will fill up my Christmas and then go into the Black Friday. We'll see. Or put some in the emergency fund, which was my initial plan for it. So, and this one we can play as long as we want. I just got to get my die, which I have no idea where it went. <laughs> um, so, I'll just grab another one. I got me some blue dice. Would you believe that I could not find a single dice in this house? So for the longest time, I had to hold off on this because I didn't have dice at all. Okay, so let's see. Rolled a four. So the four is going to get us where I'm guessing we're stuck by the way I don't have my ring on today because we finally finished putting the pickets um up and my fingers bloated so I could barely take it off so I can give my my fingers a break but my hands hurt but we're done we only have to put the gates up which is kind of crazy to me um but yeah almost there Almost to the finish line with that fence. I'm I'm so happy. Okay, let's go back into this. I'm just gonna start here. So we'll do one, two, three, four. So Xing, I think. Yeah. So save thirty-five. That means 20 and three fives. 20, 25, 30, 35. And I do not have an envelope for this, but I'm sure I can find one that's free in here. I don't know, the first. The first. There we go. And now I don't want to risk not having enough because I have 25 left. Um, and there's a 30 right there and a 50 right there. So I don't want to mess around with that. So that is it for that. Thank you so much for making it, Christina. It is awesome. And I can't wait to use it some more. Hopefully I will have the funds to play around with it more. Okay, so with the 25 that we have left, I will just put all of it in here. So that means five right here. Ten. Fifteen. Twenty. And 25 and we go so this 25 can go in here There we go. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, so that was it for today. Thank you so much for watching and sticking around with me. I do hope you enjoyed it. I know it, it was very late, but better late than never, right? Um, so yeah, I'm super happy to be back. I hope I can go back to a normal schedule now that things are slowly 
getting finished and done with um so yeah hopefully i will see you in my next video thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you did enjoy it and i would love to hear your thoughts down in the comments as always i love interacting with you guys so yeah go over there type type a bunch of things <laughs> thank you so much for watching i'll see you in my next one bye Thank you.